This is an analog clock. The larger numbers represent your hours. These sections represent five minute slash second intervals. The short black hand tells you what hour it is. The longer black hand tells you the minutes. The red hand that moves quickly tells you the seconds. Hi, my name is Raven Hannon, and today I'm going to be teaching Aiden Nesselrode how to read an analog clock. Hi, Aiden, how are you today? I'm good. Great. Do you know how to read an analog clock? No. Excellent. So, if you look over here to our analog clock, our first one, what would be your, like, guess of what this clock represents? Time. Tec technically, that's right. Um, yeah. What does the shorter black hand represent? Your hours. Perfect. And the longer black hand? Your minutes. Yes. And the red hand? Seconds. Yes. Great job. So the shorter black hand is telling us that it's what time? 12. Perfect. And the longer black hand is telling us that it is how many minutes? 36. Perfect. So that means the time overall for this clock is? 12.36. Excellent. Great job. Let's move on to another clock. So, remembering what we know from before, that this shorter black hand represents hours, that the longer black hand represents minutes, and that the red hand represents seconds, what would you say that this clock reads? 5.05. Excellent! Great job! Time to move on to some harder, more advanced clocks. If you'll direct your attention to this clock right here, what do you think it reads? 9.58. Very close, but not quite correct. See if you count. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, you'll notice that it actually reads 9, 49. Mm -hmm. But great try. Thank you. Let's move on to this clock over here. What do you think this clock reads? Um, 4, 20. Excellent. Great job. So Aiden, how do you feel about your skills when it comes to analog clocks now? I feel good. Great. For one more little try right before the road, what do you think this clock reads? 1240. Five, five, apparently. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty. <laughs>